legal nightmare is finally over for Melissa Rivers. Joan Rivers' daughter told me that her mother's death was 100% preventable. She vowed to get justice, and now Melissa has reached a multi-million dollar settlement with the clinic where a simple medical procedure turned tragic, but nothing will ever bring her mother back. How do you contain your anger against the facility and the doctors? I'm working on that. That was Melissa talking to me last year. Well, now Melissa says she can finally, quote, put the legal aspects of my mother's death behind me and ensure that those culpable for her death have accepted responsibility. Remember, this was not supposed to be a major procedure. The medical mismanagement of Joan's routine throat procedure has been well documented. In the suit, doctors were accused of failing to timely intervene when her vital signs deteriorated. One even took cell phone pictures. Melissa reached an eight-figure settlement with the defendants. Jen Perro spoke with her attorneys today. I was just with Melissa Rivers earlier this week. How is she doing? I think she's relieved to a certain extent that the case is, is resolved. But Melissa's son, Cooper, who is in love with his grandmother, he'll never get to see her again. For their part, the clinic which treated Joan released this statement. The parties agreed to settle this case to avoid protracted litigation. We remain committed to providing quality, compassionate health care. And Joan's last words in the OR? We do know that Joan, uh, before uh, she went under, was talking about how she was going to help somebody who had an autistic child. While Melissa wasn't with her mother during the procedure, she was by her side at the end. I was up by her head and I was holding her hand. And Cooper had his hand on her arm. The doctor said, she's gone.